Okay, now let's take a look at the concept of guest users. So let's make our way back to users within our tenant. And there's this button here for new guest users. So the idea between uh, behind guest users is that we're able to invite um, other users from other tenants. And this is a, a much simpler process than using Federation. Federation is the concept of uh, joining Active Directories together. So if there is an on-premise or other uh, external Active Directory, they would somehow want to connect the two together. And there's a lot of administrative burden with that. But with if everybody's already using a Azure Active Directory, it's as simple as adding a guest user. So what we're gonna do is go back to home here. I'm just going to go back to Azure Active Directory, and we're gonna switch tenants. I'm gonna go back to my Hushnik one here. And uh, you probably won't see that, that's just showing up because it wants me to use MFA. And uh, I'm gonna go here to users, and we're gonna go ahead and create ourselves a new user. I'm gonna call this one a Hushnook. And we will name it simply that. And uh, let's make note of the actual uh, email there, that's Hushnook on Microsoft.com. And we'll go ahead and create that. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to uh, copy that email there. Okay, I think I got it. Yes, I do, good. And we're gonna make our way back to Azure Active Directory. We're gonna switch tenants back to Starfleet. And we are going to go to users and we're going to add a new guest user. I'm gonna invite a user and I'm just gonna put in their email there and we will say Hushnuk. Hushnuk, and uh, we'll just put that both. And we, you hear, we, we can assign them to groups and roles. It's all the same story here. I'm just gonna go ahead and invite them. And so now they've been sent off an invitation. Notice that they show up under as guest. All right, so there you go.